a really hot day here in Kansas City, but um, here are all the black and tans. <laughs> we just came outside, so they're eager to talk and eager to say things. The one in the middle here is a pioneer, I believe. Yep. These guys, oh, there's Huffle. Chewing on a stick. This is Juno. I believe, is that right, Dave? Yeah, she's the female. Yep, she's the female, the one female in all the black tans. Hello, girlfriend. <laughs> is Pioneer. He is a bit of a talker, I will say, of all of them. Over here is Apollo. He's the biggest of the litter. Hi, Apollo. And then with the orange collar, that's New Horizons. So they're stair-stepped in size. Apollo being the largest, he's really close to 10 pounds now. Um, Horizons, I believe, is about 8 pounds. Both Juno and Pioneer are really close in size. I believe they're about six to seven. And coming up in the rear is Hubble. <laughs> I think he was 4.9 a couple of days ago. So it's kind of unique that they're all different sizes, where the black and whites are pretty all the same size. Hello, mister. We just came outside, so we're exploring their new space. This is probably the second or third time they've been out. We usually wait till they've had their first vaccination before bringing them out to nature. See in the front yard. <laughs> um, kind of like I said the other day on the phone, these guys are all really well-mannered. Well, I mean, they've got a great disposition. Their manners will come with training. <laughs> but, they all love attention. They all like to be held. No one is demonstrating any red flags, like I mentioned. Well, there's Hubble. See, he's got a voice. <laughs> I'm in there. Hey, they're talking to me, so. <laughs> Say hello. Say hello. Hey, Horizon. Hello, buddy. These are kind of in between barks and bays. What I really like about um, coon hounds is that, you know, they're, like I said, they're known for their bays, but they can be very expressive with their voices, whether they're sad or happy. They'll develop different noises that are just kind of fun. They're endearing. We have one inside that's... <laughs> Hi, guys. But, uh, yeah, Horizons and Paulo, they're... They may be a little more independent than the other three. They do, you know, they're occupied with something else right now where these guys want... Um, attention, and that's what they're talking about right now. That's Juno, I believe. Nope, nope, I'm sorry. That's, that's my little Hubble. That's Pioneer. They're all on dry food right now. They're all, you know, taking water very well. They'll be eight weeks next Friday. <laughs> They've discovered sticks. 
You might hear a lot of traffic behind me. We do live on a pretty busy street. Dope. Yeah? Who are you talking to? All very playful with each other. Hey! Hey Apollo! Hey, dude! How are you? Hello. 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 Yeah. Well, we'll get this video off to you. Um, and we'll be around the rest of the day. You can call. We'll get your nose out of there. I hope this helps. They're all gorgeous, gorgeous kids. Aren't they gorgeous kids? Oh, that's our neighbor, Libby. <laughs> <laughs> Libby's a dog lover yeah. too. Are you talking to someone? I'm talking on the recording. <laughs> no, you're fine. Yeah. They are beautiful puppies. Yes, good luck puppies. Yes, good luck puppies. <laughs> I'll take it message home. Mm, yes. We'll have to bring our other neighbor Madeline over. Might be too hot for her. Yeah, it's a scorcher sure today. Yeah, she'd probably come with her sweater on. Yeah, she probably would. <laughs> sure look alike. Yeah? Like They're just different sizes. Huh? You recorded so. Yeah, I'm recording for a, um, a potential family. Oh, yeah. You wouldn't eat that, baby. And choke on sticks. Oh, they're falling. We had that trouble once. Oh, really? Oh, there's a little bit of a bay. Yeah. Throw that head back. That's Apollo and Horizons. There's Pioneer over there with Juno, and here comes Hubble and the gang. All right, I'm not going to make this too long, so we'll get this off to you. <laughs> I'm going to put it on YouTube because um, it's easier to access that way. And uh, we'll talk to you later today.